One day we woke up and the world had changed. We were told to stay home and watch this crisis unfold in newfound isolation from our friends, family and communities. As more people became sick and the country faltered, we asked for answers only to be given rhetoric. Workers who were told they didn't deserve a living wage were then told their jobs were essential. Doctors and nurses and those providing care to the vulnerable were asked to work long hours in impossible circumstances, trying to save the lives of others. We were frightened. We were angry. We felt alone. But despite the darkness, we see hope because it is out of the ashes that a phoenix can rise. A chance for new beginnings. A chance in a new kind of world. A world that prioritizes people and the planet over polluters and profit. A world that looks at clearing skies and cleaner waterways and sees signs of a future full of possibilities. Of new ways to power our cities, and feed our neighbors and protect our fragile planet. For almost 50 years, Greenpeace has cast our gaze forward, leaned into the roughest seas, and continued a journey that started with a crew of dreamers around a kitchen table. Since setting sail in 1971, Greenpeace has been guided by hope, supported by millions of rainbow warriors around the world, inspired by the belief that there are no limits to the good we can do when we work together. We have been charting a course to the brighter future we know lies just ahead. A future where we treat one another with respect and dignity. Where we celebrate compassion and justice in the same way we've been taught to celebrate strength. A future where we realize that we are more adaptable than we thought we could be that we can change how we live and work and share our lives with one another. Where we solve the problems we were told were unsolvable. A future where we cherish every gift our planet offers. Because we know more than ever before that we're not just responsible for ourselves, but for each other. In our time, Greenpeace has weathered many storms and we've seen the sun rise over thousands and thousands of days when new things were possible. This storm will pass, and Greenpeace will continue our course toward a greener, more peaceful tomorrow. Because the world needs hope. The world needs Greenpeace. And Greenpeace needs you.